All right, it is time for Mic'd Up. We like to feature people doing amazing things from the DMV through conversations, not sound bites. Today's Mic'd Up takes us to Georgetown, where Adam Longo shows us how a coffee shop is making the world a better place for people with disabilities. A lot of prime real estate opening up here along M Street in Georgetown. We're at M and Wisconsin, where they've just opened up a brand new coffee shop. Now, just when you're thinking, how bougie could Georgetown be? Do we really need another coffee shop? I guarantee you by the end of this story, they're going to be saying, this is awesome. What took so long? Let me bring you inside. Let me introduce you to some of the folks. Welcome inside. Biddy and Bose just had their grand opening a couple of days ago. I want to introduce you to Megan Young. Hi. So congratulations. Thanks. You've landed some prime real estate here I'll in Georgetown. But tell me about the focus of your business. Why is this just not another coffee shop at Georgetown? really excited to be here in Georgetown. Our coffee shop, we employ people with intellectual and developmental disabilities, and that's what really sets us apart. We're here to show people what's possible for people with disabilities and that they make great employees. Lena here is our cashier, so she'll take your order. Hi, Lena. Very good, with a big smile. How long have you been working here now, Lena? I've been working here since the 30th, since two days. Only a couple days. How's it going so far? It's going so well so far. When your order's ready, Max is going to call it out really loud. Zach and Park. When you all had your grand opening, I mean, you turned it out. There were a ton of people out here for this. For a lot of them, it's their first job. A lot, if you think way back, a lot of our employees are 18 and up. When they're first born, parents are inundated with all that their child will never be able to do, or they'll probably never do this, or never talk. And so then, all of a sudden, to have a job, um, people come to celebrate that. They're coming to celebrate um, this achievement, and just that we've gotten to this place where people with disabilities can shine in this way. I like serving at um, Bennings and Bones because it makes people smile. <laughs> well, you've got a great smile. I think a lot of customers will come in for the first time and might have their preconceived notions about people with disabilities and what a coffee shop run by people with disabilities might look like, might taste like, for better or for worse. And so our goal is to exceed those expectations. The owners, Amy and Ben Wright, they have four children. Um, their two youngest, Biddy and Bo, have Down syndrome. Um, and their oldest has autism. And so for them, when they look to the future for their children, they know that 80% of people with disabilities don't have a job. And so they went out to change that. King of Hearts. King of Hearts. Thank you so much for talking with us. No problem. Thank you. Best of luck. We appreciate the good smile. You've got a beautiful smile. <laughs> Looks like everybody in Georgetown is going to get to see it now, so that's great. Thank you. <laughs> um, what a great legacy. Uh, I love that she told the story about the owners and their children, Biddy and Bose. I was wondering how the idea came about. That makes uh, uh, perfect sense. And uh, they have to feel good knowing yeah. what this turned into. Yeah, and, and they want to broaden it, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, their mission is to inspire people at other companies to be able to hire people with disabilities as well. I mean, these folks at the coffee shop are doing great. Why stop with coffee shops? I mean, the, these folks, they can do anything that they mm -hmm. put their minds to. It's all about just changing the perceptions of what you think somebody is capable of. Now, this business actually started six years ago um, in uh, 2016 in mm -hmm. Wilmington, North Carolina, and it has blown up. Right? They've got 26 employees there in Georgetown, 350 company-wide. They've got 12 stores right now with 17 more on the way. I mean, this is a concept that people are loving. That is awesome. And I, it, clearly they've been able to get the word out because that was a massive yeah. launch. Like, that doesn't look like any comedy shows I got. Well, just like she was saying there, it's like this is, this is an event for mm -hmm. everybody that works there. I mean, for a lot of them, it's their first job. And so it's, it's almost like a graduation, like a celebration. You get family, you get friends to come out because... You know, all their life they're told they're not going to be able to do anything like mm -hmm. this. And that's why this company and this coffee shop is so special. And, and it's not just their employee family. It's the extended family of everyone who's related to those who well, work there. Very happy we could be a part of it in D.C. and Georgetown. That's yeah. awesome. It's great. So listen, if you've got an unforgettable story that you want to share with us, something great happening in your neighborhood, at your workplace, I want to hear about it because I want to feature it. 
reach out to me, alongowsa9.com, or you can also find me there on social media. He also accepts free stuff. Make sure you send it that way. <laughs>